No, I'm the one who said stuff about Kenny. You didn't say anything. And that was afterwards, too. Yeah, it was definitely was fucking saying something about Kenny. I didn't say a fucking word. And she's like, how's John voting? I'm like, I don't know. As far as I know, he's keeping you. She's like, are you sure? I'm like, I'll, I'll ask him later. She's fucking lucky. Maybe I won't. Mm, yes, you will. My God, you got such a long eyelashes. Who cares? Is anyone even like? Are people listening to her? Oh yeah, Kenny was. Okay, well, I don't get how people still don't know she's a fucking dumbass. But who cares? Kenny's coming after you anyway, so does it really matter? No, not really. You're just annoyed, anyways. Yeah, I'm still. Like, did you say I'd, something to her? I'd like to keep him like remotely close. In fact, if you ever did make choice, I can probably like. Will you talk to him though? Oh uh, yeah, I think. What do you mean you think? I'm debating it. Yeah. One like, side of me doesn't give two fucks, and the other side of me is like, ugh. Ugh. I think if you talk to him, all he's going to do is just be like, yeah, cool, and then not really listen. I know. Sarah spoke to him, too. What is Sarah doing? Sarah? Anything different from the class? That, like, she wants two of them gone. Like, she wants, like, if Angela does what she wants to be in next week. Yeah. Which I'm fine, fucking fine with that. I'm fine with that as well, but I would prefer... Like Ro or Allison, like people who can win stuff. You know. I smack you or no? Huh? What? <laughs> Ow! What are you doing? It hurts. Is <laughs> like an actual hand? Work. I know. <laughs> that was cool. Fuck it. Fuck. <laughs> How does that hurt? Put your hand out. Other way. No. That's right. No. No, it's all bone. <laughs> you little bugger. Um, I'm just really, really happy that Andrew's not going to be in the jury house. I know. Jesus Christ, I might not be either. I might be going right after him fucking this week. What do you mean? What did Elmar use this fucking thing Oh, yeah, true. I can't, can't go We keep week. forgetting about that. I can't go this week. No. Unless no. he does some crazy ass shit. He's not going to. You're not going to leave unless there's some twist. Unless he's really bullshit with his power to begin with. Huh? Unless he doesn't even have his power. Does it th- say three weeks on his thing? Yeah. That could be a fucking ploy, too. What do you mean? Like he wrote it himself? Could fucking very well be. There's no typewriters in know, here. Sure. But they could have, I like, gave it to him, like, here's this for if you ever, you know what I mean? Like it's not an even actual power, he kind of just made it himself? Yep. Can you imagine? Nope. No. No, I mean, like, the DR gave me two separate things. And it's like, we're going to put three weeks on it so you can fool people if you want. It's really only no. for two. You suck. Later, Dilly. See you, Meatball. No. No, because he kind of knows that his, like, chance in this game right now is you and Arlie. He'd tell us. I think he has the power, so I think you're fine for another week. And then after that, unless one of them win. I'm scared, though. I think, it, like, next week you're f- or this whatever thing, you're fine. But then, if Kenny wins, if Ro, if Sabrina wins, you're going up. If Allison wins. I think I have numbers to keep me. But okay. I, what if it's you and me up on there? I don't know what happened. Well, I would probably go home. No. Yeah. Think. Yeah. Nah. No, 100%. Not a hundo. Like 90%. Why? People would think they could take you further than me anyway, so they get me out. No. Right now, at this point in the game, they need someone who can, like, help their side. You know what I mean? Sure, I'm way better in this game than you. Yes. Shut up. No, you know what I mean, though? Like, in comps and stuff. And I feel like, especially Adele and Arlie, you. I would campaign against you. I know you would. <laughs> I wouldn't campaign against you. Stop. No, you wouldn't have to. You would stay. I wouldn't campaign against you to begin with, anyway. I wouldn't campaign against you. Either. You already know. Would Shut up. You already know I wouldn't. So full of shit. You're f- more full of shit. You've lied way more to me in this game than I've lied uh, to it's you. Really first week shit. No. Reading I bullshit s- like that. I asked you that like last week. Yeah. I talked to you about the electrical thing like last week. Yes. So lay the fuck back <sighs> down before I smack you again. I really got accepted to it. Okay, it doesn't matter. So you've lied way more than I have in this game, so you can't like bring up that fucking bullshit. No, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Remember you saying about two days in a fucking row? Yeah. Two days is okay. It's not underwear. You get a yeast infection on your boobs. <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> no white stuff, it's all good. <laughs> He's 
so fucked up. I don't get why Allison's not, like, more concerned that Andrew's going home. She probably thinks she's staying. No, even when he went off on the blog. She was with me a while before, uh, you see George Street, Johnny boy. I was like, I don't know. She was like, oh, well, the decision's in your hands. I was like, threaten me one more time, bitch, see what happens. (laughs) What did you actually say? I didn't say anything, I left. I hate everyone. (laughs) You don't think, like, threats is the way to fucking do this game, like? Are you really gonna fucking scare me and be like, Oh my god, I must keep Andrew because I'm gonna see George Street. I don't give a fuck if I see George I'd love to see fucking George Street right now. <laughs> I wouldn't even care. Yeah, you would! You would say if it was me and you up on the block yeah, right now. Right now, I think... Right about now, I think... Sad, about no, but, like, realistically, you have to think about it. You have to think about... Oh my goodness. You have to, though. It is a possibility that if Rochelle, Sabrina, Kenny, possibly Sarah win, we're going up. Rochelle and Sabrina wouldn't pass up. Them. Yeah, they would. No. In a heartbeat. No, because yep. I think they'd push for Kenny and Sarah. Nope, they wouldn't do that. Why? How do you not... Look. They're not stupid. They know, they know Kenny's why? Kenny against them, so why would they work for them? <laughs> like why are they throwing you under the bus? I don't know. Because they want you gone. Because they know as soon as Andrew leaves, Kenny's gonna start working with them. Do you not see them in corners everywhere? Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, then, what the fuck? Why is Kenny complaining against her? Because. Stop it. <laughs> you're so hot, eh? I'm so hot. Uh, I'm not feeling well. Well, I think you're just like all pissy and you're not eating. I know. I just love cookies. Hmm? I just love cookies. How many? Like two? Fucking twelve. Oh, that's good. Are you full? Shitless, I was like, no. You have really nice eyes. Thank you. Sorry, I want to see more of them. <laughs> yeah, they're decent. <laughs> yeah, nice eyes too. Cool. Thanks. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay. <laughs> cool, cool. Thanks, thanks. You're welcome. No, I think they would 100% work with Kenny over you. Well, we're just going to have the fucking ones to make the makers, aren't we? Yep. I like my hair way better when it's short, like on the sides. Looks good. I actually do like it. I do. I like it. And I'll lie. <laughs> Looks good. Uh, Sabrina did one thing right in her life. I don't mind facial hair either. I'm scraggly as it is. Look at that, I don't know. But, Ugh, I don't want to. Thanks. Don't worry. I'm back. No one cares. Ask him about Marlon, I'll tell you about Easter. You have a vagina, bro. I think Big Brother made that perfectly clear to us. Why are you so mean to me all the fucking time? Oh, it's Ned. Fuck you. <laughs> you did it to me once. You're actually a pussy. Hurry the fuck up then. I'm not sure. He said if we got the fifth vote, that he would. So, what would he say? Yeah, but he's thinking about it. Exactly. So now he's still saying he's thinking about it, thinking about it. Yeah. So why is he going to Sabrina be like? Because he's lying. He wants Sabrina on this side. Yeah.
I don't know. I don't know what to do anymore. Oh, it's a storm. Hold on tight. Oh, looks like this is a doozy. You're silly. Mm-hmm. Laughter is best medicine. And is what brings us joy to life. Without laughter, there is nothing worth living for. And sex. <laughs> sex is important as well. Just not at the same time. Although that sometimes is okay too. Yeah, sometimes it's appropriate to laugh during sex. Something really funny happens, like but someone not. walks in on you or you're busted having sex in the gondola by the ski patrol. Did that happen? I never got busted. But it would have been funny. Oh. When busted having sex on the grass. In Mexico. <laughs> the security. And did they threaten to call the police? No. Oh, they just fuck. made me go back in my room. Really? Oh. On my. I got busted having on, sex in the hammock, too. On my fucking and resort. On the beach. I got busted. And on the dock. <laughs> On my resort, I got busted on the beach and they couldn't turn to call cops. Oh, really? Because they were trying to, I guess, get, get us to pay them or something. Uh huh. I was assuming. And we, like, ran away. Really? Oh, we were like, no, we weren't doing anything, man. We were just hanging out. Lay down, cuddling. Bang. Yeah. Mine was obvious banging. I was thrusting. Okay. Okay, enough of that. Canada is watching. There's no lie, there was no hiding it. Well, us neither really. What? Are you talking about Mexico? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. Oh, yes. <laughs> this is a terrible way to find out your daughter's not a virgin. At least you know it's not with me, sir. Well, it's been a nice, it's been a long battle for me. Like, I know I've only made it halfway, and I'd like to make it the rest of it, but don't look like it's gonna work out that way, honey. Not now. I do not know. Do not know. Do not know. Do you want me to cry for the rest of the day? Yes. I do. Why? I'm kidding. I don't want you to cry ever. I'm going to. Tomorrow. Don't cry for me. I'll see you now. Don't cry for me, Alice. Ne pleure pas pour moi. Ne pleure pas, pleure pas pour moi. Ouais. What? Don't worry. <laughs> Only another four to days until you win. <laughs> Do you actually think I can win? Yes. Really? I think I can win. It's just a question of how you play. That's not, game. That's not you showing me faith in me. That's you saying anybody can win. No, you can because you're a strong woman. You can fight your way through it, kill people metaphorically. It's just, it sucks when your person is gone. Yeah, but you got Arl Barks, you got Ken Dog Millionaire, you got S Sarah Bumsy Bumsy, Sab Bima, who was a little bit going crazy, but other than that. Questionable. What? Right, so, so. yeah. But everything is good otherwise. What's that, buddy? What? Shit nuggets. Shit nuggets. Why shit nuggets? It's not really nice. It's not very nice, is it? I just want to get fucking naked. And like, I would fuck a beanbag right now. 
I don't know if the beanbag would be happy about that with your Easter. Beanbag would probably be pissed no. off. What's on your shoulder there? Your elbow? Is it yeast? Yeah, probably. <laughs> Fuck's sakes, yeast everywhere. Especially you keep rolling away from me and it's pissing me off. I can believe I can touch that guy. What? Kick your arm out, Max. Show me made the mistake of his lifetime in his house. Troublemaker. What? He's a troublemaker. And then get rid of Delmeister. And then get rid of Heather. I wonder, I wonder if I could kind of use that in my advantage with Heather. What? And be like. What? You fall my way. You're safe two weeks. From, yeah. from me. Yeah, if you don't. What are you doing? Is, uh, I'm just balancing out the fucking ham, hamlock. What's up? What's happening, buddy? Chillin'. We're going for a rock. We're gonna take off from this <clears throat> place. Wanna come? <sighs> You guys, uh, I'm good on the ball. <laughs> <laughs> cool. I'm over it. All of it. I've only I've been here two weeks less than everybody else, and I'm over it. I'm over it too. Don't you don't you flick that smack mat at me? Wow. That's what I call Jay Pard's facial. Well, at least we it's found disgusting. out he has a vagina. Oh, that all makes funny. sense. Yeah, funny. Now oh, his finickiness makes sense. All the shit he's been spooling makes sense. He's been a chick all along. Yes, he has. With a big gaper. <laughs> big ol' gash. Andrew, Who's out there? You're gonna make me fall off of this thing. I thought. Oh. All the ladies. Oh, ladies. Oh, ladies. Well, Arles. Anderson. I love you, buds, but it don't look like this pig is gonna go to the market. Stinking Canada, eh? Well, Are we sure? I still like my country, but I'm pretty no, angry, at I I I angry at the voters. I just wish I'm angry at the voters of Canada. I wish I was... stayed in the house. Me too. What? Yeah, I know it would have been a lot better for us. Mm -hmm. We would have made it a nice couple more weeks before any of this shit went down. Mm -hmm. This against each other bullshit. <laughs> nice, nice few weeks. I still got your vote either way. Yeah, me and Kenny were talking a bit though. It might stir up a lot of shit. But I'll probably still do it. I'll let you know if I change my mind, though. I won't just change my mind. I don't see it stirring up any more shit than what would already be stirred up. Yeah, it is true. But whatever, man. You make your call. It doesn't bother me. Yeah, I'll let you know. Either way, everyone will know what we think. Ugh, wrenches. I never said anything. She's such an Not idiot. Not one time. I was like, well, one, there's like, nothing to say, so what are you talking about? She's like, oh, I just don't know if you're hearing things that they said that I said, but I never said anything. I was like, well, one, you're really kind of making your own bed right now by yeah. telling me you're not saying things, but I never even told you anything to begin with. Yeah. Nothing to tell, don't well, anyways, I just don't see anyone's mad because I think Sabrina's a liar. She's a liar. 
and he thinks that Sabrina controls Ro a million percent. Million? And he was upstairs talking with Ro, and he said that she was just stuttering and fucking, there was cracks all over the place. So he just told me, he said, I don't believe anything either of them say. Yeah. <clears throat> but he said neither of them, like, I didn't want to bring it out because I don't want to put something in his head yeah. if they hadn't told him yet. <clears throat> and he led me to believe that they hadn't totally outed you. Mm. So but there's nothing, there's nothing out, like, it's, you know, know what I mean? Like, that's, saying, saying. Yeah. If that's what they're telling him, they have So how does he feel with me? <clears throat> he said at this point, as soon as Andrew's gone, he said, you're, other than me, the only person in this house that he's ever made an alliance with. It's true, I think. Like, well, other than your little boy's thing or yeah, whatever. I think that's like true. a true alliance. I think that's true, too. So why can't three of us fucking work together? I want to. Like even outside, keep what we're doing with the fucking early thing. Mm -hmm. But fucking try to convince to keep fucking Kenny close as well. Mm -hmm. I agree. I still think that's an option. Because you know what? <coughs> buy, buy fucking Kenny a few weeks. Get fucking roll roll mm -hmm. down. Get the house and gone. Get fucking watch your face gone. And then me and you decide where's the best to fucking put our cars. Okay, but here's the thing. If I'm going to be with you guys, you guys have to show me. Because really right now the house is divided. Big time. And they think I'm with them. Yep. Like Serena Rowe and all that kind yep. of stuff. So the house is kind of divided that way. Yeah. So you're going to have to throw me a bone and get rid of people on your side of the house too. Like? Fucking Heather and Adele are not coming to the fucking end with us. Deal, done. So if we get rid of one from we my can't, side... I don't want to touch Adele right now when he still has that little fucking power thing. No, he's going to put Kenny up on the block. Yeah, no, no. And then, okay, first thing, if Kenny wins HOH, what is he doing with that power? Is he going to put Sabs up? Yep. Okay, so that's fine. So Kenny does... That's what I'm saying. Kenny doesn't even need to put her up. Kenny can fucking put up Heather and fucking... Someone stupid. Fucking Heather yeah. and fucking... Adele. Bam, two of them up. Yeah. Adele takes himself off. Big deal. If he does, if he Sabs doesn't. Up. Sam goes up. Yeah. I had no problem with picking Heather off either. I just can't stand how she fucking walk around the house thinking like her shit is uh, safe because she knows she, you guys have her. I'm like, fuck you. Yeah. Oh, she's the most comfortable person in the house right now. I know. She's like, it's so nice to be, see everyone in the corners and meet up being on the block. It's so cool. I, I'd like to talk to Kenny as well. Mm -hmm. Just reiterate. Because I think again, me and him can have something. I, fucking here's the thing is with the two of you is you're both scared of each other and nobody's willing to let their fucking guard down. Yeah. Like, not, not scared of each other, like to put each other up, but it's like when I think you're both in a situation where you don't want to lay all your cards out yeah, exactly. and get fucked over by hope. That if Kenny wins next week, he listens to me versus listening listening to Sabs, because she knows. But well, T, T has like he okay, Kenny's a fucking smart dude. Yeah. Smart in this game, smart side. If he believes Sabs in anything she's ever said in this fucking game, he's an idiot. He's yeah. not an idiot. I know. You know what I mean? He's not an idiot. Sarah, please fix your microphone. Sarah, hello. You know what I'm saying? It's on. It's fine. Maybe it's just hanging out too So what, what does he think happened with the trust? I don't know. He didn't get into that with me. He feels... He, his opinion, honestly, to me was that he never personally lost trust in you. He thinks he fucked up by um, playing into Andrew's want to get you out. Yeah. And he said instead of just standing up for John and keeping John on the inn, instead of making Andrew feel comfortable by making him feel like um, he was with him, he said that's where he think he, he thinks he went wrong. Yeah. Because I really think that me and Kenny could have made a lot of fucking noise in this game. Yeah. I know. And we still can. I think, I also think sometimes things in this game kind of get away from you. Like you think something in your mind and then oh, I know. And it's the stuck next there. you know something's gone and you're like oh, fuck, why did I do that <clears throat> I know anyways my biggest thing is just to not have you guys 
be enemies and have you be allies for at least a couple more weeks. Well, I'm I'm completely fine with that. As long as I know he's not going to me out, I'm not going to put him where we're going to be on the same page and who we want to go after. Mm-hmm. I just hope one of you wins and then you guys can prove it to each other. Exactly, and then yeah. Once that happens... Then it's smooth then sailing again. It. Exactly. Right? I really trips me sometimes. Really? Yeah. I don't know. I put my trust in you guys, so I'm trying to moment today about you. I'm sure you've had a moment about yeah. me. Yeah. Okay. Every it, have, yeah, everyone. Yeah. I do trust you, Mamsie. I really do. And it's hard in this game to say that you fucking trust someone. Because you know how easy it can come back and fucking kill you. I know. But I do trust you. I know, I feel that you're looking out for us and not just you. I am. That's how I feel. I am. I know you are. And I, I don't know if it will work long term. Like, I, I don't know, but my, like for me, I would love, I would love for the four of us to end up in the end. And even with Ned's as the final five. Why not? And then we just, and then we just Pick and choose. Yeah. And then even we then we can still work together and see who would be best for us to 100%. continue taking. 100%. But can I'd almost like to make a deal with Kenny? Be like, next four weeks, you don't put. I I will never put you and Sarah up. Ned will never put you and Sarah up. You never put me and Ned up. Sarah never put me and Ned up. Mm-hmm. And bam, we're down to final five, final six. Mm-hmm. And then I think even then, if we make it for the next four weeks, by then we're going to have so much of a trust, so much of a bond, mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. it's going to be second nature, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I agree. I think once the HOH is set... As long as it's not fucking sabs or roll. Oh, God. It can't be. That'll be the worst. Yeah. It can't be. But again, not that it will fucking matter. Because we'll have Adele's fucking power to take someone off and pot, and we'll decide who goes up, and That's then we true. want to go home. That's true. Right? Mm-hmm. I feel a lot more comfortable now. Good. I lost a lot of sleep over losing Kenny as a someone to work with. I know, baby. A lot of sleep over it. I know. I'm just gonna have to, I know you know where I stand I yeah. I don't want you guys to be against each other for for me in this game but also because I really do love both of you very much you're both very different but I love both of you very very much I don't think it'd be sorry for Kenny's game to come after me either I don't think so right now it doesn't make if you're not coming after him it doesn't make sense for him right. to come no. after you and I believe that you're not coming after him so hopefully I'll be able to convey that to him and I feel like I have so far it's just once, you know, we'll just have to really wait and see once the HOH comes, and then we can yeah. prove that trust to each other, and then go from there. Well, as soon as you, listen, you get one HOH and say, I win it, and I don't put Kenny up. Yeah. You know what? That has a tell him, like, okay, John's not fucking Kenny. A million percent, if you don't put him up and send him home, you've got him for the rest of the and game. And that's what I want. You know what I mean? And mm-hmm. he would have the same, like, he, he's going to have me, if he does that for me, he will have me for the rest of the game as well. I agree. And I think that's when you guys have a conversation, instead of talking long term, it should be, listen, I really want to regain the trust I have with you. And the only way we're going to be able to prove it to each other is if we do this. Yeah. And I'm willing to do it if you're willing to do it. And we will not speak of this again until that's done. Yeah. And then we'll know where we stand with each other. I'll even, yeah. Because. I'll swear on my dog to him 100%. Did I do that? Not put him up. And if he can do the same, that would be understanding where it's a word that neither one of us will go back on. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Do you think he'd be willing to do that? I think so. I don't see why not at this point. Why wouldn't he? He's losing his biggest ally right now. Totally. And he's going home. Right. He needs, he's got me, He, but I'm not enough. No. Just like, just like he's Ned, not enough just for like me. Just like Ned is not enough for exactly. me. Exactly. Yeah. So. Ned is, Ned is good. I think for me because one we're, we see eye to eye on a lot of things mm-hmm. and two she's not going to get herself in trouble by fucking running her mouth you know what mm-hmm. I mean 
No. She's, and she's smart. Like, she's not stupid. I know. She's probably the one girl in this house that will never, ever get herself in trouble by running her mouth. Only girl. Yeah. And you're a very close second. I'm close, but I you have got a little inner, inner Sarah sometimes. I have inner Sarah that comes out yeah. once in a while. And one, see, the thing is, I hate that about myself here in this game, but in the outside world, it's you awesome. don't fuck with me. No. Yeah. So... Yeah. That's why I feel protective over Nez too. It's because it's like, Ur, yeah, oh yeah, touch my girl. And she kind of, she kind of, she's like a, she's not timid, but she, I don't think she's one to like stick right up for herself. No. I mean, like you know what I mean? Yeah. Which is why I'll always have her back. She's yeah. she's the, she's the person who I I care for greatly in this game. I know. So I care for you. You're two people who inside or outside, if anyone would fuck with you two, mm -hmm. I would fuck with them. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And now I know... And, and that's how I feel about you and Kenny. I feel yeah, like you're my yeah, brother. Exactly. So if I feel like fucking you're not coming after me, you're mm -hmm. not coming after fucking Netta, your closest ally would be Kenny. Mm -hmm. If he's not coming after fucking me or Netta, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. there you go. We have so many bigger fucking fish to fry. No, I agree. Are you going to try and have a combo with him today? You think it's best? I don't know. Maybe. I think the conversation though has to be so honest. Like you have to literally be like, "Look, I know we're fucking at odds right now." Yeah. It can't be any of this fake bullshit. Oh no, I've always had your back. Da, da, da. It has to be real, true. Listen, we've like totally gone off from where we started. Yeah. I really, really want to get back there. Is it possible or is it not? And how do we do it? Both of the girls that we are closest to in this game care and trust about each other. It doesn't make sense for us not to be working together. It doesn't. And get it all out on the table. The tr with the truth that you fucking lies, everything, get it all out fucking on the table and then start fresh. Yeah. Jesus, you could have a whole pick your nose montage right now. I know, I'm nervous. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna leave here. Tell Deli I humped his bed. Oh, he's gonna be pissed. I know he will. Probably the only guy I'm ever. I'm going to fuck him. Tell me you made love? Yeah. Sweet, sweet. Oh, experience really is a wonderful thing. <laughs> ha. We just did it in the slums, boy. <laughs> Oh. Mine just came up. Why did she bring it back down for me? Get it? Get what I'm saying? Ah! Ew. Right? Up, oh, down. Sorry. I have to pee. I know. Sorry. <laughs> Stop booty shaking, Ro. Give it a fucking rest. What? So give it a fucking rest. Give it a fucking half booties. <laughs> It's good, it feels good with the cream on it. Booty pop, booty, booty, yeah. booty, booty, yeah. booty, booty yeah. pop. Booty pop, booty, 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 pop. Booty pop, booty, 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 pop. Booty pop, booty, 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 pop. Booty pop. Booty pop. Yeah, so I'm a sandy bitch. Sandy vagina. I love a good fucking sandy bee. Are you making up the grass? Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh. What? He touched my foot. Did you fucking get you off? Is there a fort? No, I just wasn't expecting There's my rats. <laughs>